So really nice long uh, reach forward, good body position, uh, good rotation or extension. Breathing looks comfortable. Head's not coming up, excuse me, head's not coming up too high when, uh, when you turn to breathe. You got a slight scissor kick with that right leg. See how it kicks out when you're extending your uh, left arm, it looks like. So you want that, you want that right leg to stay streamlined. It's not going to slow you down greatly, but it will slow you down slightly. And for longer swims, that adds up. Yeah, so it's just as you roll to breathe, the left arm is extended, uh, right leg kicks over a little. So there's not a whole bunch of stuff you can do to work on that other than thinking about it. So just be aware of what your what your legs are doing as you're reaching forward and breathing. <clears throat> so you're crossing over a bit with that right arm both hands you're extending right in front of your head my advice is to extend in front of your shoulder so your left arm would be just slightly off to your left side and your right arm and right hand would be slightly off to your right side that right arm has a pretty good catch uh, if you can get it earlier in the stroke, getting that early vertical forearm or get your high, elbow high uh, soon in the stroke, that's going to be helpful. But that right arm had a pretty good catch. Left arm is a little more of a straight arm slash elbow slip. So you start with a straight arm pull and then the elbow leads the stroke back somewhat. At the end of the video, there's a kind of a frame by frame analysis. The drills that you want to work on, a lot of one arm drill, and kind of watch what your arm is doing. Really roll that shoulder over so you can feel feel that shoulder turning internally, the elbow rotating externally. And then when you visually check, you'll see your hand and forearm angling vertical to the bottom of the pool. Pretty good pull line. That uh, left arm might be going out a little wider than I'd recommend, but that's it, it's really not bad. So <clears throat> the the catch that you're doing or the pull here, you know, it's straighting straight arm to here. Now now you start to get a little bit of the angle. What I'm looking for is uh, the forearm angle goes vertical, but the the upper arm is uh, still extended forward. <coughs> Excuse me. And then you got a good push through or finish to the stroke. And then the left. Dude, both arms really good extension, so you're doing a great job there. And then this is sort of straight arm in it. Right, looking at the angle of the forearm and the upper arm. And then you start to see the elbow come back a little bit. All right, so what you would want to see in this position is your hand and forearm straight up and down. And then, then you start to catch. So the elbow led back, and then your hand and forearm catch up. And so you get a pretty good pull through this point. So catch up drill, one arm drill, doggy paddle, maybe some tech paddles, and uh, keep working on it. But pretty good all in all. Hope that helps.